One of the big advantages of EVs is that they're cheaper and easier to maintain. The, the fleet data we've seen from the UK estimates between 20 and 40% savings. Uh, I think that's probably a bit conservative and in fact a big study from the States has just concluded the savings are around 50%. So why is that the case? Well electric motors themselves generally need no maintenance and it's hard. A motor is quite a simple thing. It's much more simple and robust than the incredible complexity of a modern petrol and diesel engine. But EVs also have other advantages. They don't have gears, so there's no gearbox. There's no clutch, they don't have exhausts, there's no catalytic converter, they'll never need an oil change. Even the brakes don't take much wear and tear because an EV does most of its braking through the, through the motor, through regenerative braking which recharges the battery. So the, the conventional brakes take very little wear and tear and we, anecdotally we've had a lot, heard lots of reports of EVs with incredible mileage that haven't even changed the brake pads yet. Of course that doesn't mean EVs require no maintenance, you must follow the manufacturer's schedule, you, you'll need to regularly check your brakes, suspension, steering etc. You also need to check your tyres and the tyres are the one thing that you might find need replacing more quickly than you're used to, particularly with a front wheel drive EV because in a two-wheel drive, front-wheel drive EV, the, those front tyres are doing most of the braking because the regen will only be through that front axle as well as all of the driving. And your handbook may well recommend switching the front and rear tyres over. You don't have to get your EVs serviced at a, at a main dealer, so just as you don't with any other vehicle. The EU block exemption legislation means that the manufacturers are not allowed to require you to go to a main dealer in order to maintain the warranty. The garage behind me today, for example, this is a member of Hevra, the Hybrid and Electric Vehicle Repair Alliance, which means they've been independently checked to have the qualifications, the tools and the equipment needed to repair EVs.